Hello, everybody. Welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation, and this is the Ouroboros King, a chess-based roguelike that I'm very excited to be checking out here today. We kind of have an early access look at it. The game is coming out in late February, so I'm excited to check it out here today. Worth noting, going in, very important right up at the top, I am not a pro at chess. I am not even a little bit of a pro at chess. I just know how the pieces move, but... <laughs> but... In this game, that's not going to be quite as relevant because we're going to be getting new pieces that don't exist in your grandfather's chess game. And we're going to be getting relics and things like that that shake things up. Otherwise, honestly, I probably would not be checking it out. So let us pop on in here and see what is going on. We got, at the start of every battle, gain a rewind. Undo your last move. Okay. The R Okay, the alarm rings whenever your king is in danger. Good to know. If the enemy only has a general left and you only have units other than your king, or and you have units other than your king, at the start of your turn, kill the enemy king. I'm assuming for this that a general is an enemy king. And then if your king is in danger after you move, automatically spend two rewinds to go back in time. Great to have. Okay, good to know. We also have like 500 bucks. Army, change your formation. Strategic map. Yeah, sure. Relics that give you permanent bonuses. Recruit new units for your army. Let's just do that here. So what the hell do we have? Move up to two times horizontally or vertically. But not all moves have to be in the same direction. So you can go boop, 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 boop. Interesting. I mean, I will... Uh, I'll just do this for a sec because I wanted to... Okay. Okay. So you have to move in a way that will ruin everything a little bit, right? So, okay. So theoretically, right, if I do this, they have to claim with that. And then if they don't have this unit, their general dies, right? Yeah. Okay. Like I could have done it cleaner, I'm sure, but that's a very fast way to do it because of the unique gimmicks of the game itself. So we have 660 bucks. Bowman, move two or more squares vertically or horiz or wait, horizontally or diagonally without jumping over units. Okay. So you these are free or we could buy a cardinal. Move any number of squares diagonally without jumping over units or one vertically or horizontally. Well, let's just probably do that. Unless, I mean, these are free. I'll just get another one. Why not? Why the hell not? If it's free, that seems hard to pass up. Upgrade a unit. All right. So now we're going to actually have to try and do things a little bit. We're going to actually have to play a little bit here. So if we do this, you'll have to protect it by moving something there, won't you? Not quite. All right, all right, now we actually have to play chess. Oh no. We could just try and move the uh, the old knight on in a little bit. Just kind of try and cause a little bit of a problem that way. Just cover a little bit more ground. Interesting. So yeah, you can, so what is this piece? Move two times horizontally or diagonally. You can move. You can move us in a pretty awkward spot, then, huh? Uh, but I suppose I'll just move you up in here for now. I'm gonna treat it like a little bit more like a turn-based tactics game. So if I move this here, you'll claim there. But I kind of am fine with that because it puts you in a really awkward position without a whole lot of help. Um, which is ideal. And then, if I move here, you can't claim this or you die. And same thing. Okay, so I need to... I don't think I can get this in a way where... Again, that's that's just safe already. So, mayhaps, we threaten this piece a little bit as we move on in a little bit more. We could even... Oh, this is interesting. We can double threaten that, kind of. Boop. 
Oh my word. <laughs> We're getting somewhere. All right, we, 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 we have to have it. We have to have it. All right, good. <laughs> I keep on, I, I keep on. It's been one other time. I forget that we, uh, we had to worry about that there. So we can upgrade somebody. Select a piece to upgrade. So the Rook does not have an upgrade. The Mounted King moves like a king or a knight. That actually sounds really useful. Uh, jump one square horizontally and two vertically or vice versa up to twice in the same direction? It has to be in the same direction, though. Okay. I mean, that lets you get them on the other side of the board very quickly. That seems really good. Uh, sacrifice up something you love for a better reward. Purchase consumable items, healing goods. I don't know, just more units sounds good. It seems like it covers a lot of ground that way. Oh, I understand. So you're just a bishop. You're a bishop slash rook that can't move one space. That's the whole thing. Okay. You're immediately annoying. But I'm actually not in any danger there, ironically enough. Should I just claim this? I Unfortunately, this rock is blocking the slot. So, this is so strange. But, like, I could move you right here, I guess, and it's not inherently dangerous. I mean, okay. If I move here, you take that. Yeah, like, you, you take up, and then I don't have anything I can do about it. Do I care? I mean, again, like, it's kind of a game of if I just, like, until it gets to be a little bit later, just, if I claim these pieces of theirs, it's kind of like there's not much they can do. That being said, I, I shouldn't be so quick to trash pieces, you know? Okay, we are good to move here if we want to. Like, if I move here, you're just going to move your piece all the way up there. So, like, we just need to think of, like, a trap, I guess, but... Um... You can't claim this. You would lose. All right. Not in danger. Not in danger, not in danger. Oh, but you are so annoying. I guess I could move in. I could threaten with... with you. It's a little bit... It feels risky to do. I... Yeah, I, I know. I'm aware. So, wait. Without jump... Without jumping over units... Theoretically, this should be safe. It is. Alright, so they're in a really bad spot now. They can't go to any of those. They can't go there. I don't really want to move anything, then. I guess I just want to move up the, uh, the king. Slowly and surely. So we can claim this, and then we win. Good deal. Knight Templar. Wait. Portal Mage, move to any unoccupied square, can only kill adjacent squares. Okay, so you can teleport anywhere. You can teleport anywhere, but you have the killing capacity of an, uh, a king. Move any number of squares diagonally or vertically. Ooh. Okay. That seems, that seems really worth spending money on. Cardinal. Okay, so am I threatened anywhere? No. Is... I don't know. Maybe there should be... If you can see the the threatened aura anyways, 
I almost feel like um, I played another game called Chess Evolved Online, which is this is feeding me that uh, more than anything else. Uh, and since you can view this anyways, and it's more of like a tactics game, I feel like having a button to like highlight to just view all of the um, the threatened squares simultaneously. I feel like there's nothing wrong with it. We could just ca wait. I just really we, we could just capture immediately, and there's nothing stopping that. First of all, I'm safe here, right? Yeah. Hmm. If I move here, do they... They don't just... Is there, like, stalemate rules? I'm not sure if there is. But if I do this, they have to capture with this, which means I win. That was quick. Dang. <laughs> See, yeah, now it's getting OP. It's getting OP. And the fact that you can just have, like, really quick acceptable losses. What is this? If kings and generals are the... Kings and generals are the only units left, get a queen. Ooh. The start of the battlefield, place a rock on the battlefield. Double the amount of gold you get as a reward. I don't know. Like a, This could be good. I wish I could grab this, but I never would have had enough money for this, right? So I guess I'll go for this. The rock I could use tact, like, tactfully. Fight E... Wait, Edia the Witch, Witch Queen? Moves like a rook, bishop, or knight. Oof. Okay, so you also move like a knight. Interestingly, it does not cover this spot. I gotta be honest. Killing the queen right away just seems really useful. <laughs> I'm I think I'm overpowered. I think I think my team is a little OP. Uh, didn't have to strategize on that one. I have 10 rewinds now, thankfully. I think that we're going to get to the point where things are going to become a problem. I like the idea of an upgrade. Leper. Move a square in any direction. When killed, transforms the killer into a leper, unless it was a king or general. Interesting. Very interesting. Am I threatened in any way? No. Seems like they may have, you know, like, standards and don't allow us to, uh... What's this? Portal gate? Units entering the portal gate exit through the other gate in the same direction they were moving. Oh. So. Could I, like. I could you You can use this to, like. Threaten pieces? So hold on. Hear me out. Am I understanding it right that, like. Yeah, look at all the spaces I threaten right now. What the heck? Am I just... You? What are you doing? Because you, you can't... If you take this, you lose. Yeah, okay. I mean, thanks for the freebie, I suppose? Uh, and then if I, if I do this, are you... If I claim there, you claim there. If I claim this... If I move here, you can't claim me back. Because otherwise... Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. We might need to shed a little blood, but I'm okay with... I'm, I'm, I've proven I'm okay with getting my hands a little bit dirty here. Uh, but the thing is, there's nothing stopping them from, from, uh, trading now. Okay, what the hell is this? If I move one, two... Buh, buh, buh. Buh. Buh, buh? <laughs> what? I guess that must be it. I, okay, I, I had not considered how weird that would be. All right. 
you know, I'm, I'm okay with trading here because we win. I love that rule, man. Being able to move the king that way sounds really... Like, I think... Because I'm probably going to end up getting rid of a bishop at some point, right? Or maybe not. Like, now I'm going to upgrade. Berserker, move up to three times horizontally or vertically. Oh, God. What do we have here? Princess, move one square horizontally, vertically, or two di or up to two diagonally. After killing a unit, it transforms into a queen. Okay, that is some important intel. Do we have any weird bops? Like, I can move you up and just be a menace. I guess, right? Wait. Make you do a little something-something. Yeah, interesting. Well, I don't really want to trade you there. Okay, what the... I'm trying to process how we can utilize the portal to our advantage here with this, and it's just kind of odd. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. It just was never... That was never going to work. Oh, okay. Uh Huh. <laughs> huh. Very huh. This is this is definitely the uh, the trickiest setup so far. I wonder if we can get any abilities that like fully just rip things in half. Am I safe here? I am safe here. It lets me do some goofy stuff. Like, we, we have weird, really weird coverage here. But this guy sucks. I think I need to, um... I would love to do a trade. There's no way that this is worth less than my bishop, right? I'd love to. Thank you. That That's so mentally freeing, it's absurd. <laughs> All right, and now we can cause a little bit of problems. So you have to move there. What? Oh, that's not your king? Wait, what? You can't move... Ho I just realized you can't move horizontally. I guess I've just not needed to so far. Oops. Okay. Well... Well, shoot. We're actually weirdly safe here. Because then we could threaten there. Oh, screw you. I could, like, move right here. But what would that really do? I could move here. I could move here, and then it's at least a trade. But, like, do I really want to keep trading? I guess it's already... Is there a way I can threaten your king? Boom, 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 boom. Am I wrong? Can't I? No, but if I... I can't threaten your king because you get to move on me first. Uh, uh, well. I guess we just accept it. Um, a little bit of danger. A little lot of bit of danger. Stinky. Uh. Okay, so what did that cover now? We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. But yeah, this this rock is actually causing a lot of annoyances. You have to move your king.
but I don't actually have this covered because of the rock. <laughs> okay. Oh, the stinky, stinky rock. I need to maybe make a move on you. Okay. I can move you here. Which is good because you can't claim it and I actually have it covered via the portal. I was hoping I had something else attacked, but you had a very good move, I guess. You got a freaking portal! It, it, the portal giveth, the portal taketh away. Uh, you know what? I actually see uh, enough in the future that if I move here, I'm fine, right? You take that, I take that, I take that. Unless, of course, you don't take that. That covers nothing. This is awkward. I don't have anybody covering that. I can't cover that. That's protected. Uh, we could just force you to make a move right now, I guess. Just looking at where you can go. Okay. Thanks. All right, so you can claim there. You can also, you can claim diagonally, but if I move you here, you have to move your king anyways. All right, we got it. Man, that was way, way more involved than anything else so far. Not even close. Okay, so relics. I do have a lot of money. You can get a lot of units, though. Let's go for relics. Let's just see what's up. Oh my god. Wait, this is... Okay, excuse me? This is not fair? This is... That's not allowed? You have three units threatening me immediately. So if you move down here, the thing is like whatever you take, I could just, I can take back. If I, let's see, what do I have? If I move here, I can move boom and eh, boom, boom. That's not that good here. I can go boom. Hey, eh, it's irrelevant here. I die. Wow, this is... This feels like it shouldn't be allowed, if I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Doesn't feel like it should really be allowed. If I claim that, what's the worst that happens? The worst that happens is you move out. You have to claim here. I do that. Or you claim... Or you could probably trade there. Ah, I guess we just have to start spilling some blood. Like, spilling blood it is, then. Hmm. Just gotta be careful, because there's some weird angles. Oh, you dirty devil. If I did this, you would you would capture my rook with your general, 100%. 100%. Well, but you can't. It's protected. So if I did this, you would have to move this here, right? You'd have to? Am I wrong? If I move up here via the portal, if you claim here, you, you can't. You die. If you claim here, you can't. You die. You have to... The only move is to move him here. 
Okay. Odd stuff. So we kind of want to leave you. So now there's nothing stopping you from taking that, is there? So we need to make there something that's stopping you from taking it. Um, <laughs> oh my word. So yeah. Uh, I suppose we could also just like back up. Again, force you to make the move. Okay. Am I just okay with that? I think I maybe is just okay with that. Or I could just move you... Move you in. If I move you in, maybe like here? Why not? Sure. Oh my god, I almost beefed it. I forgot that there is still a Rook alive. I got got bad. I got got bad. Give me give me an undo. Oh. Oh, that's just filthy. Oh, I actually don't know that there's anything I can do about it aside from threaten the king. No, I can't throw the king. I'm in check. Um, yeah, I just think, actually think that there's nothing I can do about that. I think... I th think... I think that's all I can do. So if you're... I, I guess I can set myself up in a for a better spot after knowing that you will take this no matter what. That's That's happening. So if that's happening, the best I can do is... Ah, God. Nothing, really. No, there's no good thing here. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Shoot! I'm sure there's a great move, and I'm screaming at my screen about it, but, like... But, like... Yeah, I don't know. I think I, I think it's just, uh, I think that's just bad. That was a good move by you, computer. You know how the funny winged horse work. Uh, if I did one, two, three, one, two, three, it's just whatever. I don't want to sit here all... All day. That's... Yeah, that's right. I knew there was a reason why. I don't want to sit here all day. Like, I already feel like I have. So, I kind of... I have only two options, and it's here or here. And I don't know which one's better, if I'm going to be honest. So, I think that that... I think that that was the best move I had, which... Truthfully, sucks. I can force them to get rid of one of their two... Moves like a... Oh, I didn't realize that was an Agent X. Yeah. Like, I just... I'm gonna have them do a little bit of trading. Just kind of be a menace. All right. Well, I win. Okay, thank God. Ugh! <laughs> that, I hated that. Upon pickup, get two random consumables every three turns. Get an extra move? Bishops and cardinals can move through rocks. That's very cool. Uh, every three turns, get an extra move. Wait, set at a price. You can never move the same unit... Oh, I thought you just meant on the extra turn. That's a big deal. That is a... Okay. Okay. I did not process...
that those were two separate concepts. Oh no. That's no good. Move up to two squares horizontally or any number of squares vertically jumping over other units. Two horizontally or vertically jumping over other units. So how many of my units are threatened right away? None. That's pretty good. Okay, I'll take it. The princess, it's not fully tear. Oh, wait. Okay, but here's the thing. The second I move it up there, you know what happens? I don't get it. Okay, I need to set up for like a really good turn three is what I need to do. Is this threatened anywhere? It is now. Oh my god. Wait, I just realized how wild that is. I just realized how wild that is. You can it's it's jumps. That's nuts. Uh, so what would claim? I mean, it, like, anything could. But if I did that, then you'd probably do... No, you wouldn't do that. You would just do, like, this. Recover the... The king. And then I would do, what, this? Oh, God, that could be a bloodbath. But I have it permanently protected there. Which is kind of interesting. Am I going to just accept that the knight's gone and then trade it? I guess. Like, it's, this is it just it kind of... The situation just kind of sucks, I don't, if I'm going to be honest. Okay. Maybe I don't understand how this works. Or maybe you just don't want to trade. If I move up here, what would that really gain me? Not a lot. Not a lot. Uh, this is this has turned sour. This has turned so sour. This turned so brain focused so fast. It was so easy when I could just do two moves and be done with the whole thing. Uh, but now it's so delicate. Everything is so delicate. Like, there's so many ways that I can get bodied. Am I really going to just let them do the thing? Well, I get to move two... Wait, I get to move two times in one turn, right? Wait. But I can't move the same unit. I get to move two times in the same turn, but I can't move the same unit because this is now turn three. Okay. This is my time to do something. And what is that something? It should be very good. So here we go. Uh, what pieces can I threaten? I can only... The only piece I can threaten on the entire map is the princess. And that's the one I don't really care about that much right now. Uh, but you are threatening here. So I think we claim it with you. Right? Like we just might as well get value out of it. And then we get a move again. But it can't be you. You're the only one I can't move. So you're going to go away, but we could set up a good situation uh, for what happens after, right? We got to set up. A, so we have that already on lock. Double covered, like double covered. Diagonal, diagonal. Ay, boy, ay, 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 boy, ay, ay. I think we just move here. Okay, so... It's so annoyingly messy. So I'm threatened... I'm threatened all over the place here. You are threatening a lot. So I'm... The question is, do I make you come to me? If I move here, I could make you come to me and claim this if you want something. If you do, then I would take... I guess I would take this after. 
doesn't. Actually, you can't move this. Actually, you can't move that. Okay. Uh, screw you. So I can move you up. What do, what's your plan? Your your plan is to threaten my king from down there. That's that's your plan, right? Because you can just do that. So I guess I do this. <laughs> Having a little walk and talk, I see here, huh? You can't do diagonals, and I can do diagonals, so I can- I can't move him! Oh, My god. I can't move him, so I guess I- I need to cover it some other way? <laughs> Dang it. Uh, this is gonna ruin something. Wait, what? Oh, do I, I get to go again? It, wait, this is the double turn again? Oh, shoot. That's too much power. That's too much power. So if we have this set up, like... <laughs> uh, I'm actually kind of safe here. Weirdly. But then you would claim here, and then what? Do we? What else do we do there? Then that's just free, I guess. Like I don't, I don't really want to give that for free. So maybe we just again. Am I throwing something away? Okay, two. All right, that that had to be moved. You can claim there or there. If you claim here, if you... Okay, so you moved now, so this is no longer threatened by this. Um, that's the, that's the big thing there. Buh! And that is a big thing, because that's what's stopping you from moving and, and bopping me. So you are going to claim something. I can basically just choose which thing I want claimed. I don't want either claimed, but if you claim this, then I move my king down and capture. This is not looking good. This is not looking good. I can't move that guy again! I can't move that guy again. I hate this item. I keep on trying to click this guy, and I'm like, I, I guess it's not my turn. That item is so wild. Well, we I guess we can come to him, right? If we were fine with him taking that piece anyways, we might as well come to him. Which is odd here. Uh I'm I'm moments away from from finally balloozing here, and that is okay. And then you can go play the game yourself instead of backseating. <laughs> Sorry, I just already know. I just already know. It's just too obvious. Um so we have the king, we got this, the knight here. I'm down material, and this leper is really awkward. So you are threatening here. That is unacceptable. So if I threaten your king, what? Like, what really happens? I wish I could move you again. I wish so bad that I could move you again. So if I move you here, it's not really that big of a gain, actually. Because if I move you, move you here, I can like I can claim this, but the leper is just covering everything so that I can't, uh, I, I, like I can't stop anything else. So.
I might need to, like, I feel like I need to utilize the portal in some gimmicky way. But I don't know how right now. If I sit right here, you have to. Am I wrong? You have. This is just normal bishop. You have to move this out of the way. There's nothing else you can do, even if I'm sitting right here. But if I'm sitting right here, I can't move it next turn. I cannot move it next turn because of my stupid item. So I think we just kind of are screwed. Yeah. Let's try and do something gimmicky, I guess. Uh, kind of just like separating out the king is really, really nice. I can't, I can't move the king again. If I move you here, you can't move dia or uh, horizontally. You cannot move horizontally. But if I move you here, I am threatening the king, right? Yeah. Okay. King is threatened. King is threatened there. I kind of want to get this on the black tiles or something. Like I feel like that would be really helpful. And I, I like I have the tools to do so. All right. I am threatened. I am now threatened back. So, I have to either put myself in a spot where the king is now, th their king is now threatened. I can get on the black tiles, but, like, I can't get on the black tiles and threaten the king on the same turn. I don't think I can get to a spot where I can threaten the... Uh, wait, I can threaten the king with my own king. Oh. Oh, you don't have that tile covered? I can't, I can't move my king. I can't move my king. Okay. Do I really get to move two times in a row right now? I think I do. Oh yeah, I don't get, <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. So I can't claim this because I uh, I get hit by the knight after. Yeah. Yeah. Looking mighty grim. Sure. I mean, <laughs> yes, thank you. I I did I did manage to catch that one. It was a little fast. Thank you. Oh, we get to go again? But... But... Okay, if you would have known that I can't move my king after, like, if you had that... I'm glad they don't have that in their AI as, like, something they know. That helps us out a lot. Oh, shoot. I just... I hate that. I hate that I took that. I hate that I took it. Okay. Again, little do they know, I actually could not have gotten that. Get this garbage out of the way. And then now I'm turned into a leper. Oh, this is my... Is this my double turn? This is my double turn? Okay, just don't mess up here. Don't mess up here. Okay, I can't sacrifice my king though. I actually, I actually did it. I actually freaking did it. 
I really thought I beefed that too hard to fix. I really thought I did. What would you like to buy? On your next move, the unit can fly over rocks and... And bombs? Select an enemy unit and downgrade it past, past your turn. After your next move, the moving unit returns to its initial location? That's huge. I'm buying two of those. That lets me, like, pop on in, get a kill, and back out. Oh, Tabitha the Deceptive. Move like any of the enemy units except for portal mages. Are you threatening me? You are threatening me. Alrighty. Of course you can. Of course you can. Uh, I will say that I do love just like getting rid of that. Oh, you had you were something else. You are not just a normal guy. Uh, this is turn three. Oh, oh no, you're you move like a rook now though. Do I? I mean, I guess if I'm a leper, if I turn into a leper, it's not that bad. So is this my third move? I, this is not my third move. Uh, I can move up here and kind of just be weirdly safe. I suppose it's just such awkward angles. But yeah, like I could claim that and then pop back, but I'm just not sure if I can. I should be able to. What? Oh, it's just it's just letting me know like you that got swapped. I guess so. I'm not threatened anywhere. Wait, this is broken. That's... I knew... I mean, I'm just gonna... Because this was gonna be the last fight. That's so... That's so unbelievably good. Okay. You can claim that. Do I care? Please claim it. Oh, shoot. <laughs> uh, oh, we should set up like a... this. You could set up a discovered check. With like a... a oh, we should set up a... Dis that's what Cursed Staff is ultimately best used for. Setting it up so like say that this was right here and this was right here I could move move you know what I'm saying so like I could try and do it but like it just doesn't I mean honestly like not right here but like here and here you know what I'm saying like if I move the horse then I have check mate like that is uh, is the way of doing it but I actually if I could move this guy I, I, I win but I can't move him right now All right. We did it. The enemy has a relic, apparently, as well. I didn't even realize. But holy moly, uh, my brain is fried, and that is that. And that is going to do it here for today. I really like it. This is something that I am very looking forward to playing off-camera without an audience. Because it's very fun and very strategic. But the pressure to go quick and then ultimately just, like, not be able to. But you kind of put yourself in this loop cycle of like I don't want to freaking misplay this because it's chess and every like you know the chess fans are loud fans so I don't know what to do there but I really like it I think it's very fun I think it's it's doing something like a Pondarian or or something like that but ultimately much more chess 
Uh, this is perhaps the most chess-forward, chess roguelike I've seen, while still providing a, a lot of fresh new stuff, uh, like the ultimately new units and everything, I think are very fun. Sorry, it got a lot louder here. But I liked it a lot. That is that, though. That is going to do it here for today. Thank you for watching. My name is Retromation. Cover indie games every single day, every single day with an extra specialty in roguelikes and roguelites. That is something you are into. This is a channel that you should be subscribed to. Uh, there's a link at the top of the description if you want to check out the game for yourself. Do please wishlist it. Uh, coming out on February 27th. So keep it wishlisted. Check it out then. I, I really like it. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.